Wednesday. Great oh. to have you back oh, again. Thanks. We had a great day yesterday. Did you have a good sleep last night? I actually, I did sleep more <laughs> last night. Well, as we learned yesterday, I'm, I'm, uh, I come from a Hungarian father, uh, right. but I also have a Scottish mother, and uh, so. Oh, well, there's some wild. Mixing. Yeah. So last night, just to be safe, I used there's an age-old uh, Scottish remedy where you uh, plug in the kettle to boil some water, and mm -hmm. um, you you get a glass and put about that much scotch in it, and then you drink the scotch, unplug the kettle, and go to bed. <laughs> so it uh, works like a charm. Works like works for you good. Yeah. So I'm, uh, well, it's one. good to have you back again. Well, thanks. Glad to Star be here. Star of stage and screen and Woo! everything else, and we're going to see some of your work in just a little bit. But first, let's tell everybody about today's show because we have got some tools. January in with us. The today. brain is it's important. Bigger. It's a very important, it's very important thing. It's very yeah. important. So get around. Do you know that uh, in addition to my acting, I also do uh, statistical analysis on databases. So, uh, yes, I would have guessed so that, Terry. I, I that get to, I get, I get to work too. both sides of my brain. Well, that's, given day. I have my math side and I have my side. But that's your background, right? It Before is. Before you took the plunge and decided it that is. you were going to go into acting full force, mm -hmm. data management? Data management, 22 years in the market research industry now. Wow. Yeah, doing data management and consulting and helping people uh, market their products and figure out uh, where the niche is for each market, that kind of thing. See, so. and as you say that... My mathematically not inclined mind starts to hear blah, 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 blah as you're explaining. It, <laughs> it I, was, I, was, I, I actually got a little scared at one point where I was getting a little thrilled by reading the budget. It was, uh, <laughs> kind of scared me a bit. That's not a good sign? No, so I went out and sang Broadway songs for half an hour just to get it out of my system. <laughs> I like that. Yeah. Listen, you brought some facts about the little known facts about the budget? Oh, situation? yes. Well, I went online and I was reading about the budget, and they have this little section called quirky items now did That's you know every Canadian wants to know. know there were quirky in the items new, in, in the, the new budget there is one million dollars to encourage youth to play heritage sports such as three down football and lacrosse any of our kids play either three down football or lacrosse? money well spent <laughs> <laughs> now this is scary because we talk about exercise and the need for exercise and, and yes. maybe this isn't the, the association but the first thing I, I thought of um, was people sitting around and just eating more and that's probably wrong and people can call and send hate mail and whatever but they've <laughs> increased the amount that truck drivers can deduct for meals while on the road so now you can get the super sized exactly. platter exactly and write it all off it's a bonus uh, there is a six million dollars being dedicated for scrappage I just like that word scrappage, scrappage. yeah scrappage it sounds like a game it's, a fun, it's one of the heritage games it's a fun to get pre-1995 cars off the road. So if you're driving a 1994 Taurus, it's not a junker anymore. Give you cash. It's a scrappage. <laughs> uh, plus they are doubling the value of goods Canadians can bring back tax-free after 48 hours to $400. I don't know why that's in the no, budget, no which is kind of weird. I don't know who's forking over, like why they're necessarily forking money over for that. I guess they're giving up know. duties. They're giving up duty for that. Well, that be, we'll Doubling the value, maybe well, it just makes my, them more, so that's why it goes in the... That, that could impact the amount of scotch I can buy for my evening remedies. <laughs> uh, and lastly, there's $15 million being dedicated to entice foreign convention tourism <laughs> to Canada. <laughs> so, you know, when Dubai gets sick of their own country, they can come they here and have a party. They can come here and have a party. Yeah. So those, those and other highlights coming up with Mike Hayhoe. <laughs> I think yeah. that's Listen, did you bring just since this is your your final did. day here? Did, did you bring a little bit of a I, I sample, sample of your well, work? Well, because along you were kind time? enough to uh, to talk about uh, some of the stuff that I'd done and show a little bit of Hollywood land and uh, that yesterday. So uh, there's a website called myhair.com where you can actually go on and you stick your picture and it will come oh, back okay. and tell you who your celebrity lookalikes are. So I did this. I don't know if you have. Do you have the picture there? Well, let's see. Let's see if they pop up. There, there it we is. go. There I am. It's not a great picture of me, but you can see. My celebrity lookalikes, Jeff Bridges, Aidan Quinn, Val Kilmer, William H. Macy, Dermot Mulroney, we, George Clooney. I need some of these Look pictures. Think of George Johnny Clooney. Dick. I know. I know. Who no, I didn't mean to sound so surprised when I said that, but I was just thinking. Well, may, I think that was maybe they, they caught a hint of my wife in there, and so George Clooney <laughs> came up. <laughs> to make her happy? To make, yeah. To, what is uh, it? It gives a percentage it of, gives how, a percentage much of look, how much you look like. And, and like a lot of it is funny because if you come up with a different picture and you turn your face a different way, it may come up with something different. Uh, it was very interesting, but I thought... Uh, wouldn't it be fun, since it's my last day here, I went to the RogersTelevision.com website, oh. grabbed a picture of our very own <laughs> Susan Cook Shear. Do I look like William H. Macy? You, no. my dear, look, look like, like Mira Servino, oh. Juliet Binoche, wow. Farrah Fawcett, 
<laughs> Sofia Coppola. Were they Carmen, looking at my hair from the late 80s? Carmen Were they? Electra. Really? Yes. You saw it here oh. first on daytime. <laughs> I just thought, what a great site. So, yeah, I go to uh, myheritage.com, throw in a picture, have some fun. If I started flipping my hair like this, you could do maybe the Farrah well, Fawcett thing. You know, we're, we're right in the middle of the 1980s for the, the show. Maybe I, it's, it's, I was uh, known to wear a headband every once in a while in my you? younger days. Yeah, and run around Talk with a gun. Charlie's Angels. <laughs> yeah. sure. All you have to do is the pose. <laughs> That's all you have to do. Yes, yeah. the Charlie's Angels pose. Exactly. Well, thank you for that. That's very oh, nice. A little too. A little bit. Oh, no. Okay, there we go. Oh, look. That's a beautiful cat. Are you starting to see more cats come into the shelter? We're heading into that time of year. We're starting to head into that now. We actually haven't uh, really had an increase here. Yes, yeah, exactly. So, yeah. There's more to it than just having the kittens there. C could I just take a minute to do the Nikki thing there and kind of lay across your lap and hang my head down like that? <laughs> And are you good with older children too, Terry? There we go. All right, we've got a dog now that's up for adoption. This is Dallas. Budget 101? Budget 101. I've got my pen. We'll take notes next. Stay with us. Can we return?